Hi there RT aliens and either welcome to or welcome back to my channel. Today I am investigating the drawing of doodles. Yes, the art form known as doodling or scribbling. So I pretty much found this watching a video from ADC Art Attack who referenced a colouring book by Vex and decided to incorporate something like that into this month's Chris Foss challenge so do lots of sort of pictures in his style but also in a doodle art style so what I did the previous day which was the 19th I went through and I sketched out a whole bunch of stuff while watching TV so pretty much uh, not much thought goes into it and then the next day I went through and I added the line art and I also colored it in uh, there's a few things here that I sort of found I liked once I finished it there's a sort of a squat gray spaceship towards the bottom the rockets which we'll see later colored in blue a fancy um, there's sort of a wedge shaped ship to the right uh, the claws to the top right and the weird tubes coming out of a hole to the again the right I all thought were good so I then today went through and added them into my sketch pad and put them in the sort of starship component uh, directory I have also I put in the um, red edges as well so yeah I didn't worry too much about line weight or anything some of the shadows I did when I was coloring this in and I also added some extra detail on top of the sketch to sort of fill in some of the, the bigger white spots so just a couple of things like a mech foot and a really small spaceship and maybe a cargo container and a couple of other components that I have as reference images for spaceships and then once that was done what I did was I went through and did some coloring so here what I was trying to do was to use complementary colors and not have too much of the same color in the same space I used a mix of neutral grays warm grays cool greys, greens, reds, blues, pinks, pretty much the whole gamut of the uh, Copics I have and I don't know what happened to this yellow marker, it's got black on the tip and it just rubs off everywhere so I might need to replace the tip. So yeah, so as I went colouring in, some of the colouring was sort of a shell shading style, I did start off with the green alien head you can see on the left as sort of a blended thing. That ship there I used a couple of different grey categories and it sort of comes out okay uh, the rooster here is based on or rooster man is based on one of chris foss's dune concepts so that was the the emperor for some reason he was wearing a rooster suit uh, so as i'm coloring in this scene i'm going through a couple of different thinking patterns it's either let's just use one color and find wherever we can use it and then the other thought patterns is let's just work on coloring one specific thing and then move on to the next and this sort of happens pretty much randomly as I go on uh, the other thing I like which I didn't actually put onto another sketch paper was that weird sort of organic looking snouted spaceship so maybe I can investigate that at some point so this being my first sort of attempt at do the lot, I've gone through and pretty much just played with a few things like various colouring styles, uh, various shading techniques, and also I haven't filled the entire background in, which uh, is what like, most of the do the lot I've seen does. But it is a first go, and I think it worked out reasonably okay. Uh, I guess that's one of those things that you got to know the rules, the breaker rules. Uh, so supposedly not supposed to draw stuff over some other stuff but I did so there that's me being artistically creative so here's the finished piece uh, what do you think uh, if you like I can put up the line art on its own and you could do your own job of filling it in and share it with me and show you how you would do it and possibly we can learn from each other so anyway, uh, check me out on various social media platforms. You really only have to follow one because most of it's just a cut and paste of another site. Uh, Snazzy stuff on my design website. And yeah, subscribe if you're not yet. 
Bye. Take care.